Hey there, Adam Savage here in my cave with a show and tell that is a gift from a fan uh, who is a colleague of a friend of mine. And it is a delightful, delightful show and tell. <clears throat> this comes from maker Kate, Kylie Clark. Kylie Clark sent me this letter saying, uh, it was an honor to build these silly things for you. She said she became a fan of mine 18 years ago. Uh, her maker journey has been unpredictable and non-linear. Hasn't all of ours. Uh, <laughs> she says, no matter what she's building, whether it's stop motion or puppets or specialty props, she can always check in and see what we've been up to here uh, in the cave. Um, what Kylie has made for me, so that, that, that list of things, puppets, stop motion, gives you some idea for potentially um, what Kylie has made me is a kind of an amazing, a, a, a wonderful invention. I, I'm not sure if it's her invention or not, but this is really freaking cool, especially in a day and age where we are all wearing masks all the time. Well, Kylie has made a really impressive mask. Dude! <laughs> I know. It almost works with my mouth. Yeah. Look. I, I, yeah. <laughs> this, I love this. I, okay, full stop. This isn't protecting anyone, and nor would I wear only this out in public. Let's be just totally clear. This is not a mask for using in any kind of medical way. I mean, I guess you could wear a mask underneath this. That would totally be fine. But let's be clear, I'm not under the impression that this is protecting anybody. Okay, with that being said, how cool is this? This is, this is like real, this is like real hand puppet manufacturing quality here. I'm looking at a type of fleece with beautiful um, hidden seams. If you look really close, you kind of catch a seam here, but it's not easy. What Kylie says is these are made out of Fuzzell, F-U-Z-Z-E-L-L-E, -L -L -E, a new puppet fleece proprietary to puppetpelts.com. Um, she says it's awesome. These are also made with fleece, cotton broadcloth, signed plastic, barge glue, hot glue, Fabri-Tac, 16 gauge steel wire, and two kinds of elastic. Kylie, you really know me if you considered making that laundry list and then did it, because I love laundry lists of materials. Um, but this is not the only mask that Kylie sent me. This is the least adorned for, as a lifelong, um, um, I'm not gonna say sufferer of freckles, as a lifelong wearer of freckles, I found this mask to be much more, yeah, this is, this is much more like, that. this is me, right? So we got some ostrich feathers for that. Secondary movement we like to talk about with the puppets. <laughs> I just love this. There's so much joy in this shape strapped to my head. How delightful. Kylie also generously and amazingly uh, included this slightly smaller blue mask for Tested's own Kristen Lomazny. And I believe this is the first time Kristen is finding out about this. Kristen, we'll get this to you next time you come by the cave. Yeah, Kylie Clark, thank you so much for the generous gift. These are brilliant and awesome, and I see the care and the love, and I, I thank you. I thank you. Um, we are going to put together a little care package for you and send it back your way as a as a thank you. Uh, and Ben Eady, my good friend who introduced us, thank you very much. Um, ben is the maker of among many other things of the uh, foam chain mail that we covered on Tested last year. Yeah, okay, I think that's everything. Thank you guys for joining me for this uh, show and tell, and I will see you next time. <laughs>